Welcome to Microsoft Mechanics. In the next few minutes, I'll introduce you to the new Cassandra API for Azure Cosmos DB, which allows you to move your existing Cassandra applications to Azure Cosmos DB without modifying a single line of code and take advantage of this fully managed, globally distributed database service with limitless scale. Here, I have a sample Cassandra application, which I found on GitHub. It's a chat application. I can already see a message here from Scott. This app is built using Node.js, and it uses Cassandra to store chat messages. Here, I have it connected to a local Cassandra cluster running on my laptop. To move this app to Azure Cosmos DB, all I need to do is to go to the portal, click New, create Azure Cosmos DB account. Note, in addition to Azure standard properties, I can also select the data model and API to use. Cosmos DB is a multimodal database service, and it allows you to work with documents using SQL or MongoDB API, key value pairs using Azure Table API, or graphs using Gremlin API. And now it also supports Cassandra API at the protocol level, which means your existing Cassandra apps and tools will continue to work as is with Cosmos DB. Now it takes a few moments to create an account, so I've done it in advance. Once you create an account, the first thing you see is a quick start that guides you on the steps to connect your existing Cassandra application to Cosmos DB. For Node.js app, all I need to do is to copy this snippet of code, go to my app in Visual Studio Code, and replace the Cassandra connection code with the code I copied. Now, I also need to create a Cassandra key space and a table my app needs. I will use these Cassandra CQL commands and run them using CQL shell. Note that CQL shell does not know anything about Cosmos DB. It just executes these CQL commands against Cosmos DB endpoint, thinking it's a Cassandra cluster. We are ready. Now let's restart the app and go back to the browser and answer to Scott. Now, if we go back to the Azure Cosmos DB portal, you can see in the Data Explorer that our Cassandra app is now writing into Cosmos DB. Within the portal, you can easily manage and query your Cassandra tables, or you can continue to use the SQL shell if you prefer. With just a few steps, we were able to move our sample Cassandra web app to Cosmos DB without modifying a single line of code. Now, the reason this is so exciting is that I can now take advantage of Cosmos DB as an infinitely scalable, globally distributed, managed database service. In the portal, I can select Scale and Settings and provision throughput for my Cassandra table to handle up to 10 million transactions per second with one click of a mouse. If you want, you can also programmatically provision throughput with a single API call. To demonstrate the scale in action, I have another copy of this table with a simulated ingestion rate of up to 5 million transactions per second in Cosmos DB. This eliminates the need to manage your Cassandra cluster yourself or spending days adding nodes and modifying your Cassandra config. With Cosmos DB, you specify the throughput you need, and we guarantee it with 4.9 SLA independently of the amount of data you store. Cosmos DB also guarantees that your reads and writes will be served in single-digit millisecond latencies at the 99th percentile, no matter the ingestion rate. With Cosmos DB, you don't need to worry about compaction, memory, CPU, or disk I.O. It is a fully managed service. Azure Cosmos DB is built with global distribution at its core. I can simply click with my mouse on a map and bring my Cassandra data to every region in the world where my users are. And this happens in minutes versus weeks it takes to set up additional Cassandra replica clusters. Now, writing distributed applications is not easy. To further help you, Cosmos DB offers five intuitive consistency models to choose from, each with a clear trade-off between performance and desired consistency. You don't need to worry about replica sets, quorums, or read repair. You can now focus on writing correct application logic. Cosmos DB is a fully managed service, and it offers industry-leading SLAs not just for high availability, which is five nines, but also four nine SLAs for consistency, latency, and throughput. And we transparently show you how we perform against SLAs here in the portal. Hopefully, this gives you a quick idea of how seamlessly you can bring your existing Cassandra applications to Azure Cosmos DB. No code changes are required. It works with your favorite Cassandra tools and drivers, including, for example, native Cassandra driver for Spark. 
and it takes seconds to get going and is elastically and globally scalable. The Cassandra API for Azure Cosmos DB is in preview. To try it for yourself, go to the link shown and request access. And give us feedback on Stack Overflow as you start testing. Thank you for watching.